Hello, good afternoon, welcome back to PlayStation Access, my name is Dave, uh, although obviously today I must insist it's a matter of respect, uh, Captain, Captain Jackson please, Captain Jackson of, I don't know actually, I'm not sure, <laughs> I'm not sure who we're working to, someone said Big Dave right away and I, 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 gotta, I, I haven't done, I haven't, I haven't set up Big Dave, I'm just going to hope, oh! It's worked. Hello, everybody. Um, how is everybody doing today? Uh, welcome to PlayStation Access. Thank you for joining me. It's so good to see so many people here in the chat already. Uh, I've seen Oliver Bath. I've seen Lucy Sobey. I've seen Troy. I'm seeing Alex, who says, hi, Captain. Good start, Alex. Thank you very much. Uh, Marion is here. Uh, Sarah without the H. J H. H. Sorry, Sarah. Jason, Corbin, yes, Captain. The USS Axis, Access. My goodness me, I just can't speak today. I'm so sorry. Nikki uh, Sordi says USS Access, which is actually a pretty good shout. I don't know why I didn't go with that. Hello, Shazanikin. Good to see you. Um, Big Dave says KC Wonder ninety nine. Hi, Dave. Not General Jackson says uh, Brian Devine. Well, not yet. Not yet. So. Um, I should explain. Hello. There's lots of hellos. Hello, hello. Domino's here. Yes. Captain going to go down with the ship, says Domino. Thanks, Domino. That's the sort of love and support I've come to expect from you. Um, but you're mistaken because it's not that kind of ship. It's a spaceship. And in space, there is no down. The everywhere is... Every direction is every direction. Is that right? I don't know. There's no down anyway. Not until we get near... A planet. Then, it, there, then I suppose I could very much be going down with the ship. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, we're playing Space Crew this afternoon. I'm going to play for about an hour and a half, um, and uh, hopefully it will be a lot of fun. I don't know if anybody caught the um, Bomber Crew uh, stream, which maybe was I don't know two years ago now. Um, Space Crew is made by the same people. It's uh, I guess it's not a sequel because I don't think there's any canon. <laughs> Involved, but it's made by the same people and it's very much the same idea, uh, although with some really good um, updates, I think. Rob is here. Hello, Rob. Or should I say, in fact, Rob, it's good you're here. Um, should I say Security Officer Pearson? So um, we are looking. I should go to small, minimal Dave. Uh, let me remember how to do that. That's right. There we are. I'm a professional. Uh, minimal Dave, this is my space crew. Uh, you will see all of Access is up present. Um, let's let's take a, a closer look. Here's Captain David Jackson. I haven't unlocked any glasses yet, so um, you'll have to just imagine my glasses. And at that moment, you'll see if I show you uh, if I show you me without a helmet, you'll see. Oh, it's the spit. It's the absolute spit of David Jackson, Captain Jackson. He's just not wearing his glasses. Don't need glasses in space. Um, we've got uh, communications officer Milman. Welcome aboard, Ash. Good to have you with us. Uh, we've got Engineer Caddick. I've struggled with Rosie's hair the most. I've got, I'm not going to lie. Rosie, I don't think I've done you justice. I don't think she's watching right now, so that's good. Uh, hello to Jan Peter in, in Finland. I love just... Oh, if you have ever watched the stream, you'll know I love just calling out where people are in the world. Whether it's true or not, I'm believing... Uh, Jan Peter is in Finland, and it's really, really good to hear from you. Hope things are going well over there. We got as far as uh, this is quite a good likeness, if you if you know Dan. I'm quite pleased with it. He's got the same hair as me, in uh, Space Crew at least. Um, Ensign Dan, sorry, it took me ages there because I know that I've made G Nathan. I've made him Gunnery Chief. Dan, he couldn't be Gunnery Chief as well. I didn't want him just to be Gunner. So he's Ensign Dan. Or, I guess, Ensign Wheeler. And uh, Nathan Dighton is, of course, Gunnery Chief Dighton. And I've got his little sad face, which I think is pretty pretty spot on. Um, who I just saw someone saying... Oh, Alex says, so wait, what is Space Crew? We're going to get into that. We're going to get into that. It's basically a real-time, not always real-time, kind of strategy management game. Basically, you take the control of a crew of people on a spaceship who have to do missions, and um, a lot uh, will go wrong. Definitely. A lot will go wrong, and it is, uh, it is permadeath. So when these members of my crew are killed, if... Come on, Dave. If these members of my crew are killed, they won't be coming back. So, but... As we found out in Bomber Crew, that's a really nice opportunity 
to uh, get everybody, get people from the, the chat involved. And I seem to remember that Oliver Bath, you actually made it into the bomber crew. Am I, am I correct? I was going to talk about Rob anyway, because I want to show, I haven't made Rob yet. I thought I could just show off the, uh, the character customization really quick and also just show you how easy it is to make Rob in any game. Um, Rob knows this. Let's see, how pale do... I think Rob's got... A, uh, he's not the palest. Um, let's sort out facial hair colour. He's got quite a dark beard, hasn't he? I don't know how dark will go. I think that, yeah, that dark. Let's see. I don't think he's not a little goatee guy. He's a big old. He's a big. He's a bigger beard man. That's it. And then I think hair color. Let's get that right. Same as the beard, I think. And we've got to we've got to choose the right bald here. I think it's this one. For me, that is Rob. That is a great likeness. And so you know. I, I hope you all agree. Rob Pearson made. There you go. Very easy. Very easy to do that. So um, we are... Um, let me just make sure that I have equipped everybody with a helmet. I don't know why Ash isn't wearing her helmet. That's good. Okay, she is. Good. Right, so here's the crew. We are the crew of, I can show you, the Excess. I, I don't know why I didn't go with the USS Access. I feel like a, a bit of a fool. What's that noise? Oh, it's the ship. There was really... W I thought there was a noise behind me. Look, it is October, okay? I get particularly worried around October. It's the sound of the hangar I can hear. I forgot that I'm playing a game and it has sounds. So, um, this is our ship. You can see... You'll see in the game that um, our crew will be inside it and we'll be... I can't believe I did that. We'll be, like, managing systems and stuff. You can come here, basically, uh, every time you complete a mission, you earn money and a research points. I don't know what you do with research points yet. And you can spend the money on upgrading your ship. You unlock uh, systems and things, and you, up, you can upgrade them. So, for, you know, like, for example, better armor. And you can choose... Oh, my God, we've got no armor here. So how much is armor? Actually, there was something I wanted to get. It was a better shield generator. Um, let's improve the shield generator. That's a 1,000 credits. Oh, that is getting expensive. How much is the armor? Because I'd really like some. A thou oh, it's okay. 750. 750. Should we go mid upper or mid lower? I think mid lower because, in my experience, they tend to attack from below. Okay, good. I'm feeling good. Right, we're really low on money now. Um, <laughs> I am checking the uh, the chat. Everybody, what's going on? Dave is getting ready for spooks, says Rosie Caddick. Oh, Rosie. Come on now, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Can I just have, like, can I just have one October without any fear, you know? It's like, just one. Just one. I feel like I should be the center of kind of like um, a charity drive, you know? Like, all Dave wants this October is to not be scared. But unfortunately, his friends are determined to make him horrified. Uh, right, we're going to crack on. Let's get into the game. You get the, you'll get the picture once we get into it. So, um, I have played this game for about 45 minutes. I think I've done like the first three missions or something. They're very... Um, at that point, they were very um, tutorially. So, we're going to see what we get into now. Okay, let's start. We're going to start with a low risk. I think let's go low risk to begin with. Uh, I should say that... Um, <laughs> Rosie says, you were the one who got spooked by a spaceship. Yes, I was, Rosie, I know. In a hangar. It was particularly concerning. Um, so we're going to we're gonna start with a, a low risk. I did make a community post earlier. Go and check it out. There's a poll about who you think will die first. Uh, and weirdly, I, I promise you, this was just a complete... Well, I guess it was, you know, subconscious decision. I didn't put my name down. I've decided that Captain Jackson will not be getting killed today. We'll see. So we're going to investigate some phasmid activity. Um, investigate reports of phasmid activity near the Kuiper Belt Alpha. Clear out any hostile forces in the area. Okay, let's do it. And we can get into the game and see what it looks like. I'm going to have a, uh, a swig of carbonated water. Hmm. Rob says colleagues, Dave, colleagues. You're right, of course, Rob, although I, w I did choose my words carefully because I think of you all as my best friends. So, unlike some people, naming no names. Okay, so here we go. This is sort of, um, this is, um, 
this is space crew. This is our ship. Can I zoom out? Yes, I can. So I can zoom out. We're in the hangar at the moment. You can see everybody at their stations. Um, gunnery Chief Dytum at the tail gun there. Uh, Ensign Dan nearest to us. Uh, Jackson, Millman, and Pearson all all in the uh, on the bridge, and uh, Engineer Caddick in the engineering station. Let's take off. So I have to select Captain Jackson. Hip launch. We'll get a little. Um, we'll get a little. A little cut scene. So as I said, this is very much a kind of strategy management game. It's done in real time. Although you can, if you can see at the top left. You can uh, slow time and accelerate time. I've forgotten that I've like stuck myself in front of some important HUD elements here. It's basically the 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 shields, the map of the shields, and the reactor health. We'll just have to, you know, we're not going to need the, the shields and the reactor are going to be fine. So if I zoom out, it don't. You, whoops, that's the wrong button. If you if I zoom out, you don't have to uh, stay in in inside the ship. We can come out. We can look around. Uh, I don't know if anybody played um, Bomber Crew or saw our stream last time. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, this game, it's like, I just really like how they've um, they've taken it to the next level. I think it really looks gorgeous, actually. Maybe gorgeous is is a, is a bit strong, but I just think they've really like upped the quality of everything. And being in space, I mean, I'm very. E Any time we're in space, I very easily um, get excited about that. So, right, we need to go to the Kuiper Belt. So in order to do that, um, each of the crew members has control of the different systems. So I have to like choose a, ch a crew member. You can see what they can do. So Captain Jackson basically kind of, kind of pilots the ship, I suppose. Um, Engineer Caddick... Engineer is really important in this game, I think, is is routing the power. So you can see we've got four, like, am I in the way? Four, no, four, like, um, points of power that we can spread throughout the ship. So at the moment, there's one point in everything. Um, my thoughts are that we don't need gravity. Gravity is only useful when you're moving around. So I like to turn off gravity. You can see now that, like, the gravity thing is flashing like I've got no power and then put it into something else so we'll go we'll go for engines for now we'll speed up a bit and the way that you navigate in uh, space crew is you you tag stuff you hold L2 and then you can look around so if I look around at our jump gate it'll get tagged and Captain Jackson will automatically head over there um, and we can speed up time to get to get over there a little bit faster and I can have a look at the uh, at the chat, Eric Bizzano said, "I loved Bomber Crew a ton. Good choice, Eric Bizzano. I, I I I really did too. Although I did find it stressful. I am not great with permadeath because, especially if you name them, if you name your characters, your crew after people you actually know, it can get you can get pretty hard. So anyway, we're going to um, jump to the next area." I haven't decided which, which... I quite like to be outside the ship and just being able to look around. But when I... Um, you don't need to do that to access like, the ship's systems and stuff. You can stay outside. Um, so let's do that. We, we'll charge our, charge our hyperdrive and we'll get off to the next... Uh, the next um, system. Troy Green says, blow something up, gunner. I intend to. Right, so we've got asteroids. Okay, we've got instantly. We've got bad. We've got bad guys. Um, I hate to, I need to tag them so that the gunners know where to fire. Oh God, Hup and Garrett. That's a named enemy. Oh, this is the first named enemy that I've come across. We instantly need to. Uh, I need to do something with the shields here. I think I might even just turn off the engines. And um, oh my goodness, it's all happening. Go straight to. I'm going to slow time because I can talk to you a little bit better if I slow time. So, I've not come across a named person before, and it's a bit of a concern. Your engineer can use the boost skill to temporarily increase the amount of power provided by the reactor. They can, so I'm going to use that boost skill, which is something Rosie has earned. And then I'm going to stick some extra power into shields and weapons. Then I'm going to go down to tail gunner, ditem, and focus fire. And wheeler, you can focus fire. And actually, Millman, you can't, you're not doing any good back there, so I can move... Millman into it's weird saying calling Ash Millman. I'm not gonna do that. Ash. But because we've got no uh because we've Oh my god, my ship is taking an absolute hang hammering here. 
I, I gotta, I gotta adjust. I gotta adjust something. <laughs> Slow time. Let's let's go less with the weapons, more with the engines. Actually, let's lower the engines. Let's let's put the engines up because we're getting absolutely destroyed. I'm just gonna make sure everyone is, is tagged. If we can get rid of Hugh and Garrett, I will feel a lot better about this. Uh, I'm gonna make Jackson go defensive, which means that I should orient the ship to uh, to keep the, the most shielded parts of it towards the the enemies. But also, we have got we've got asteroids ev everywhere. I mean, t someone tell me the odds of surviving a an asteroid field. He didn't survive it. Also, because I, because um, Ash Officer Millman is uh, my. Did I not manage to defeat Cuban Garrett? Oh, I'm disappointed. Oh my God, we're getting absolutely smashed here. Okay, I think it's I think it's I think it's over. What's happened? Your your engines have no power. Okay, Rosie, go go go. We need we need you to get on this. Right, so I'm going to slow time again. I'm going to pause. Just take a breath for a minute. It's very intense, this game. It's very intense. Okay, I've slowed time. We've got no engine power. I'm going to send Rosie out into space to repair the engines, which will, so I can do that by selecting Rosie. She needs to get on a spacesuit, obviously. Then I'll send her out there. Meanwhile, I'm going to get Officer Pearson into the front gunnery seat because... Uh, and I'm going to unslow time because um, just in case we get attacked. The only thing is, without Ash in um, without Ash in the communications chair, I have no scanner. Bottom right, you can see I've got no scanner. Oh wait a minute! I didn't need to. I didn't need to. Rosie didn't need to go outside at all. It's just a power thing. Rosie, come back in. Come back in. I've gone absolutely mad. Come back in. Oh, Magnet says, it's not intense, Dave, it's in spaceships, which I respect. Uh, unlike my own ability to captain this uh, bucket of bolts, we're going to get hit by an asteroid, everyone. Oh, my God. <laughs> Both asteroids. We'll head back to the, we'll head to the, the Kuiper Belt. Uh, Rosie, we need to... What happened was, I now know, that um, Rosie's boost ran out, so the engines ran out of power. So... Everybody just calm down. Can everybody just calm down for a minute, please? That's what I, That's what we need. Um, I'm going back into the ship. We're just going to check systems. How is everything doing? Everything's undamaged, so we're all fine here. Everything's fine. How are you? Um, right. So we're going on to the next. We're going on to the next uh, area. We haven't even reached our de destination, even though the Kuiper Belt is an asteroid belt. That was. That was very tough. Uh, Maurice, Maurizio, Mauricio says easy mission. He said, "That's what I. That's what I was told." Okay, uh, clear enemies. So we've got enemies coming. Ash isn't in the communications chair, so I have no way of knowing where they're coming from. So I'm going to have to pick up my visual scanning. I need to tag them. What is the en the energy situation? That seems right to me. I can use another boost. Okay, here we go. We're getting shot. There they are. I see them. I can give us another boost if needs be. Why wouldn't I? I'm gonna boost I'm gonna boost energy and I'm gonna apply it to weapons. Actually go to shields. I'm gonna make sure that we're piloting defensively. And I'm going to make sure we got a focus fire. Dighton, focus fire! The tail gonna get some, seems to get a lot of action in this game, although now we've gone over to to Ash's side, I think. Right, more enemies to tag. This is no good. Wheeler. Focus fire. Focusing fire just means that your gunners are 100% accurate for the amount of tire I, I think that they uh, that it happens. What else have we got? I can't... So, because I've taken Ash out of her chair, I can't use any of her special abilities. And I've taken Rob out of his chair as well, so I can't use any of his special abilities. How are we doing? We're, not, we're doing okay. Shields, shields are restored a little bit. The, gen the gravity generator requires repair. Not going to worry about that for a second. Uh, 
We haven't cleared all the enemies yet. I've not been using the gravity generator because um, I just think it's a bit of a waste of power. I thought I saw them. Did I see them? Here we go. Oh, we got some big boys. We got some big boys, everybody. Rosie's going to run out of boost. She's run out of boost. I'm going to keep that where it is. Although, to be honest, oh my goodness, there's loads of them. I might get Pearson back into his chair. We got a trophy, everyone. We got a trophy. If I get him back into his chair, he can restore shields instantly. So I might do that. Uh, shield. He can replenish shields. Do it. Do it. Replenish shields, Pearson. Replenish shields. Is he doing it? He's done it. Okay. And then he might as well get back into the into the hot seat. Meanwhile, outside. It continues to go badly. We fight the fight. We fight the good fight. There's still not all the all the enemies, is it? We've done it. Oh, <laughs> Oliver Bath says, "Me then." Oh, a nice access stream will calm me down. Me now. Ah, which is exactly how I feel. You know, they say no. When you're in space, no one can hear you scream. But the thing is, I'm not actually in space. I'm. I'm. I'm here, and, and you can hear me scream. I'm going to get everybody back to their uh, stations. Who's taken the most damage? Rob has. Right, Rob, i tell you what. Why don't you go and get yourself cleaned up? Um, Rosie, you might as well go and um, fix the gravity generator, because it looks like it's going to catch on fire. And we will head back to base, which is through this... This... Uh, jump gate. And I will take a look at the chat. Oh my goodness me. I tell you what, this is really, really tense. It's a lot. It's a lot. I find this game difficult at the best of times. Honestly, when you're trying to uh, stream as well. Jason Corbin says Hugh and Garrett got away though. Yeah, he did. I, I, don't, I don't know how. I'm pretty disappointed about that. Fall says... Can you play this single player? Not entirely sure what you mean for. I am playing it single player. Do you mean with one member of a crew? I think, you know, if your crew died, one pi one member of the crew probably could pilot this. It would just be extremely difficult. Okay, let's um let's hurry along a little bit. The oxygen the oxygen generator is is disabled. Why? Okay, Rosie, get on it immediately. Because we need oxygen to live. This is what this game is like. It's uh, it's not just, you know, it's really not that simple. There's loads of like things that will just go wrong, and your ship will conk out. And uh, you know, when you're in the middle of battle and you're managing a, uh, a destroyed oxygen system or whatever, it's next an absolute nightmare. So enemies are incoming. You can see uh, the bottom right on the scanner. So I'm going to get out of here. I, I'm not afraid to say it. I'm going to get out of here. Dermy Ward says Sigourney Jackson, which is absolute nonsense. You know Sigourney is way, way braver than me. Uh, we need to get Rosie back into her engineering station immediately. Because we've got, we've got bad guys incoming. Uh, I need to scan them. Okay, they're over here. And I'm going to get... I'm going to get Ash back into the hot seat, I think. Ash... Where are you? Get into the gun immediately. Rosie, what's going on? That looks okay. That looks okay. Your engineer can use the boost skill. I mean, I guess we should just use it. Anytime we can use it, we should use it. And I'm going to put it on shields and weapons. Back outside. We are heading towards the jump gate. The big problem is... Oh, hello. Well, first of all, the, all the bad guys. But second of all, just look at these just like random asteroids that are just absolutely determined to uh, to smash me up. Well, there are quite a lot of enemies here. Okay, I'm going to focus fire again. And hopefully that will just take care of a few of them. We have lost... Un we have lost... Under look at that asteroid! Nothing I can do about it! Just a cheeky little ball of rock that has decided... It's not my day today. Oh, and another one. Cool. 
That is really not what I need when I've got a bunch of bad guys uh, after me. Please, asteroids. Can we talk about this? This is actually going okay, I think. This last one. Okay, we're actually, we can charge. So, you are, you can charge. Here's the thing, though. Oh, my God, there's more. If I charge, I will lose all power to everything. I'm just going to do it. Let's just get out of here. Why are we, why are we messing around? Oh, it's going to take ages. Why is it going to take that long? Cancel hyper jump. We got to, we got to deal with the enemies. So when you charge your hyper drive, you, all the power you have goes to the, uh, to the engine. So you lose power to your shield. You lose power to your gravity generator. Who's injured? Who's injured? Captain Jackson? No, he's not injured. I'm not buying it. I'm not buying it. There's no way Captain Jackson is in trouble here. No way. Okay, we're starting to take them out now. Come on. Although the rear shields are taking quite a beating. Captain Jackson, go defensive for God's sake. Okay, right. We made it happen. So, I think now we're going to charge a lot quicker. When there are enemies around, charging takes, takes longer. And time for another breath. How's everybody? <laughs> Max says more like Asterood Belt, <laughs> which is very good. Asterood is absolutely top draw punnage. You uh, have won Captain Jackson's respect today. Uh, congratulations. I'm taking a look at the uh, chat. Rob is here. Well done, Rob. Uh, you were uh, absolutely effective during that last mission. You restored uh, power to the shield to, uh, in the nick of time. Thank you very much. So, in, unlike something like a um, an XCOM, for example, as far as I'm aware, um, health is not perpetual. It's not pe perpetual. Health is not like carried over. So, you know, Captain Jackson was in a bit of a bad way at the end of that mission. He's going to be fine. Back at back at base. I can't believe we didn't get the Phasmid Champion Bounty. But the XS has returned successful. I've earned 1,500 credits and some research points, which I don't know what they're for yet, but pretty exciting. Let's see, did anybody level up? It's looking like we're pretty close to leveling up here. Yes! Yes, things have arrived. Me and Rob have leveled up. I have got evasive piloting. Don't know what that means. I mean, I've got a good guess. And Rob has got stealth mode. Ooh! I like the sound of stealth mode. So evasive piloting performs evasive maneuvers to reduce the chance of getting hit. I mean, it sounds good. It doesn't sound as good as defense piloting, which I've currently got. And Rob, Officer Pearson, has, got, has earned renders the ship invisible to enemy fighters. Weapons officer will not fire. Ooh. Could be good. I wonder how long it lasts. I like the sound of it. What have we unlocked? We've unlocked an engineering tool. This advanced engineering tool greatly improves the efficiency of repairing ship systems. So I don't know. Well, you saw really quickly that um, I sent Rosie out into the void of space, and she had to put on a space a space suit. So there are lockers around your ship, like Bomber Crew. If you play Bomber Crew, where you can store like equipment. So this is a new thing we can store. That is very cool. That is very very cool. So, um, I've unlocked some crew gear. What did I unlock? Maybe it's just uh, to announce that we've got new um, new skills. Because I don't think I unlocked any new um, gear. Oh, <gasps> okay. So, right. How much is and uh, how much is repair equipment? Because I always I play this a bit too much like a role play and I always send Rosie the engineer to, to fix stuff which is maybe silly I'm trying to think I've got to think here I'm gonna buy Rosie one it's pretty cheap Rosie's definitely getting one because it's it's role playing and she's she's the engineer so Rosie you're definitely getting yourself an engineering tool that's happened how many credits we've got left? 1810. Okay. Now who else would who else would be good for fixing stuff? Maybe Ash. I feel like I feel like the communications is the least useful when I'm getting it, when it's all going wrong. I probably, you know, Rob can do his stealth thing now or his or or his uh 
shield thing. I need to fly the ship. It's going to be Ash. Ash, you are going to uh, also get yourself an engineering tool. So they, are, everybody, remember that when things go wrong, when things go wrong, these are our, we've got a. This is who we turn to: uh, Officer Millman and Officer Caddick. Right, that's good. Is there anything um, we can do to our ship to make it a bit better? We've got. I didn't, but I could probably get another bit of hull, a bit of, of armor. By the way, you can adjust your own livery and you can draw your own uh, like decals. Look, I made that. Could you guess? <laughs> could you guess that I made the the uh, triangle, circle, cross, and square? I know, it didn't come with the game. I made that myself. There's a little editor I can show you. Why not? I will show you. Um, where you can you can draw in your own stuff like just like this there you go it's 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 the start of James Bond <laughs> let's not do that let's cancel that nobody wants that we'll stick with we'll stick with mine anyway um what could what can so this is the equipment i was talking about here are the lockers look so you can have rifles you can have um fire extinguishers spacesuits uh, and med packs. I have previously had to use the rifles. Let me, and I thought about where to put them uh, in the ship. Here's something else that's exciting: escape pods. We've got one escape pod. So I said that this is a uh, this is a game with permadeath. I think this is how you can get out of of permadeath: is you can stick someone. Uh, in a, an escape pod, although I don't think it's guaranteed that they'll they'll survive. So I'm not going to worry about that because we're trying to kill our crew. No, we're not. Of course we're not. Uh, I've got all the standard engines. Weapons, I've set up how I want them, so I'm not going to look at that. We've got the better shield generator. We can't go any better with anything else. So the only thing we could upgrade is the armor, and I think we should. I mean, why would we not have extra armor? It's 1,500 quid. God. All right. Okay. Uh, I'm going to check. There's nothing we can do in training. I don't think there is anything we can do in training, but just in case, I'm going to check. I think that you can learn a secondary skill. So Captain Jackson, for example, could retrain, could train a secondary skill and, and become like an engineer as well. But oh, look at that! The next thing, or not the next thing, but one of the things I can learn is an inspirational speech. That is, that's absolutely me down to a T. All right, I'm going to stop uh, messing around now, and we're going to look at what we've got. Uh, what time is it? 4:30. You're going to make me do a medium risk, aren't you? You're going to make me do a medium, a medium risk. Draco says hello, Dave live stream. Yes, hello. That's me, and welcome to the stream. Don't skimp on armor, Dave, says Sword in the Storm. Don't worry, I haven't. Uh, let's see. Let's go for... I don't want to escort a transport. That sounds really, really stressful. Let's go with clear enemy forces. Clear enemy forces sounds straightforward, doesn't it? We've detected what could be a cluster of invaders near Uranus. Stop it. Stop it. The sector must be cleared out. This is no laughing matter. Oh, they beat me to it. They beat me to it. What are we going to get? 2,500... 2,250... I guess you kind of look at what the rewards you're going to get are. It looks like all the medium ones... Are okay. Yeah, well, I'm definitely not doing that one. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Joseph PS4 guy is laughing at Dave's inspirational speech. And I don't know why. If I unlock uh, an inspirational speech during this stream, I will give an inspirational speech when giving an inspirational speech. How about that? I'm not going to unlock it. Um, everything's looking ship shape and uh, Bristol fashion. So, I guess we should just go. It's not like I'm trying to... It's not like I'm trying to... You know, put it off or anything. It's fine. Uh, Varys says Uranus, not Uranus. I, are you saying Uranus? Uranus. People who say Uranus are just scared. Okay. They're scared, and they they need to accept it. Um, right. So 
just checking it out. So piloting mode defensive is not the same as evasive piloting. So I think we can use defensive piloting and evasive piloting at the same time. That's what I'm getting from them being in these two different boxes. So that's good to know. Um, and where is stealth mode? There we are. Stealth mode engage. Um, oh no. I've just seen this. I've not seen this before. Atmospheric purge controls. Uh, this reminds me of another game I've played called FTL, which uh, some people may be aware of. So you can get boarded in this game, which is why you have the rifles on board. And it looks like you can purge the atmosphere in certain sections of the ship. Oh, I don't want that to happen. Not, not today. Not today, please. Okay, right. Captain Jackson, uh, where are we headed? Navigate to Uranus. The fastest route... Or the safest route. Come on. Come on. We're not playing that kind of game. Um, D3 Mystic says... So this is this, this game, another kind of XCOM deal. Well, I mean, there, there are similarities. XCOM is, of course... There, there are a lot of similarities. XCOM is, of course, turn-based. This is kind of real-time, although you can slow time. You can also accelerate time. Uh, like this. And... It's more management-y because you have people who are good at certain things but everyone can do everything. I mean, like, someone else can come and sit in the engineer's chair. So it's not quite as straightforward as that. Right, let's go. Uh, Vicious Broccoli says, I've seen too many space movies to know this doesn't end well. Right, I've slowed things down because enemies are, in are incoming and I'm streaming and I'm stressed. So, we're just going to take our time. We're going to lower the gravity because we don't need it right now. And we're going to increase power to shields. And we're going to accelerate time and we're going to find them and tag them. Uh, right, there they are. What would you call that? Three o'clock. Wheeler, focus fire. Uh, Jackson, defensive piloting, please. And navigate. That was good work. I'll tell you what, is it too soon for... Uh... Oh, God, there's more. We've got more. We've got more incoming. I need Officer Millman to the front seat, please. Get in the front seat. That's what we call that. Uh, how are our systems doing? Do we need to boost anything? I don't think so. Should we get Officer Dighton to... He's been you know, very accurate, actually. This has been quite... That was quite the uh, impressive... Oh, God. It was going quite well until it wasn't. How are we doing? How are we doing? Oh, my God. So this is... Okay, wait. No, this is no good. This is not good. Because that is how they board. They board from behind. We were almost boarded there. It's fine. It's fine. All is fine. Um, we'll carry on to Uranus. Which way to Uranus? The comm station is unmanned, so I don't get roof route information. Well, it's got to be towards Venus, hasn't it? Let's just start doing that, and I'll get I'll get Officer Ash back into her comms chair. We're still learning. We're all learning. Um, that is the right way. I knew it was. Uh, okay, that's gone pretty well. That's gone pretty well. I didn't have to use too many uh, special abilities or anything. What's everybody saying? Don't get cocky, kid. It says bring back floppy dogs. I'm worried that I, I don't know what floppy dogs are, and I keep saying it could be anything. Uh, I didn't have a sip. What an idiot. Lucy Sobey says, you clean that up quick, Dave. I did, actually. Uh, we're quite a well-oiled crew at this point, um, to be fair. Um, let's... I didn't bother fast-forwarding there. Okay. So this is Venus. This is not even our destination, because our, de our destination is, you'll remember, Uranus. Enemies incoming again. you got to love it. you got to love it. Um, I need to get a bead on them. For, let's crack on towards that anyway. Jackson, get ready to go defensive. Come on enemies, where are you? Where are you? 
I wonder. I tell you what. Let's give it. I'm going to give it a go. If we've got time, I'm going to go to stealth mode. Stealth mode engage. What? Well, cancel stealth mode then, because they they found us. I don't know how, but they found me. Run for it, Marty! I've gone defensive again, and I'm going to get a prep some engine situation. We've got more coming in the other direction. Let's see if we can get Dytum to focus fire. I'm assuming Dan, he can focus fire. Yes, Dan! And I think it, this seems to be quite a lot of them now. So I'm going to get Rosie to boost boost power, and we're going to put that into in weapons and shields. Weapons and shields. They're getting too close. They're getting too close. I don't like it. I don't want to be boarded. I don't want to be boarded. I need to get Ash into the front seat again. Ash, pop in the front seat, would you? Um, because that guy's just sat right there just shooting at us. I know the conversation is a man, but that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Okay, that's gone. That's gone. That's gone. We've got these guys back here. They're already being tagged. Is there anyone else? Looks okay. Look at that. Is that tiny earth? getting attacked. I haven't tagged them yet. Oh god, there's loads of them. How's everybody doing? Rosie's taking a bit of a beating. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. I'm guessing... Oh god, yeah. Um, just replenish shields, Rob, please, if you don't mind. Thanks, love. I might... Now that Rob has done that, I'm going to pop him in the other, the other seat. He might as well. Looks like one of our engines is taking a bit of a beating here. That is a good skill, that shield restore thing. I think this is all going all right. It's a little bit, it's a little bit tense. How are we doing on the focus fire? It takes its time to come back. I'm guessing Rosie's boost is well off. Yeah, that's not happening. That is not happening anytime soon. I could divert engine power to weapons, maybe. Not going to do it. Not going to do it. Not going to do it. Look at all this XP. Lovely XP. You've got to love it. You could definitely do some grinding in this game, I think, because the enemies like to just keep on coming. I think we've got this. Doesn't look like anyone else is coming. I've got two kinds of weapon on this ship. One is like good for hull and one is good for shields. But I'm not sure how best to sort of distribute them. The way I've done it is yes. Yes. The way I've done it is uh, wait a minute, we don't know what do we want to go to the series the series asteroid belt? Oh god, that's quite a long way. Um it's front and back is like for shields and side to side is for hulls, but I don't know if that's a good idea. Ash, pop back in the old uh, comms chair for me, would you? Thanks very much. Um, right. Oh. I haven't blinked in ages. I just got, I just, excuse me for a minute whilst I just shut my eyes. It's perfectly normal. It's a captain thing. We get, you get taught that. If you, uh, if you've done captaincy training like me. Oh, don't want to go on about it. Okay. Um, how are we doing? Everything looks to be, oh, look at this. So I'm in the way, but. That, I can't, I don't know. Ugh. Get out of the way, Dave. The reactor, the uh, reactor's health, it's behind my chair, is just about to, um, it's just about to go bad. So I'm going to preempt that and get Rosie in on uh, fixing it. Of course, Rosie has her special fixing tool, which um, we, we kitted her out with, so this shouldn't take a minute. And it gives me more time to... Uh, Look at the chat. You're the boss, Dave, says uh, bring back fluffy dogs. I am. I mean, officially the captain. The captain is the boss, though, isn't it? I guess. I am the captain of the ship calling. Okay. Let's charge. Let's get out of here. Enemies incoming. Not now. Not now, please. With it. I've got to, I've got to get to Uranus. Okay, asteroid warning is never good. Even worse than that. Uh, Hupen Garrett, everyone! It's Hupen Garrett. I am going to immediately get Ash back into the front seat. Ash. <gasps> Fighter support! I forgot that Ash can call in combat support. Let's do that. 
Let's do that. And then Ash. Get pop into the pop into the front seat, would you? Come on. Come on everybody. Where's my fighter support? Is that them? These are bad guys. My god, there's loads of them. Where are my fighter support? There they are. Yes. Yes. Take out Hugh and Garrett. You can't catch me. I'm a little grey man. Hang on. Nate, have you got focus fire? I need it, man. I need it. I think Dan's got focus fire as well. Let's just do it. Let's do it. We're not even at our destination. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. He's coming. Right. Action stations. Rob. Oh, God. Right. Slow time. I need Rosie. Rosie, I need you, please. Please, Rosie. Um, can you boost power to weapons and shields? And then, can you pick up a gun? Please. Quickly now. Oh, God. And then, Captain Jackson, what the hell do you think you're doing? Get yourself a gun. And let's get this done. I've slowed time because it's all getting a bit intense. Attack enemies, Rosie. Jackson, come on. They will just destroy bits of my... Why is Nate out of his seat? What's going on? Yes, attack enemies. Nathan, what's going on? What's happened? Why why are you why are you in a terrible spot? Rosie, quickly now. Or Jackson, anybody shoot that annoying. Right. Uh Jackson. Let's slow time again. Oh my god, this is going mad. Get there. Rosie, I need you back in your seat. Quick, sharp. Nate. How many bad guys are we looking at? Just Hugh and Garrett. This, this one too. And this one. Oh god, there's loads of them. We've got to defeat Hugh and Garrett. I'm just wondering whether I should send send Nate to the infirmary, but I think it's going to be more useful not to do that right now. Rosie, anything you can do? Well, we're not. We don't have a captain right now, so I'm going to turn the engines off, and turn the weapons up. Did we get Hupen? How are we not getting Hupen Garrett? Why are there more? Why are there more? Okay. Um, everybody just as you are, as you were. Where is Captain Jackson right now? Where's the gun? Okay, the gun's there. Right. Fly defensive for God's sake. In fact, evasive piloting. Um, what's that mean? Radiation? Oh God, no. No. Why is there radiation? Nathan, Nathan, go to, go and heal yourself. Dan, you're going to have to just deal with the radiation a little bit. What's happened? Okay, everybody just take a moment here. Nathan, you heal up. Rosie, you're going out. You're going out to deal with the radiation. I believe in you. Where on earth can you get a, sp a space suit? This is incredibly tense. Incredibly tense. My God. Uh, Crow Valclamore says, calling support from Holly and Elle. Uh Rosie, let's head out here, shall we? Head out to... Um My God, I've just realised I'm sending Rosie out into the, into the void of space. Ash, you can get back into your comms chair. Looks like you're suffering, suffering from radiation poisoning as well everybody this is horrible let's get going to where are where are we going Uranus this was the safe route everybody this was the safe route Rosie's gonna have that fixed in a jiffy officer Millman is not looking great right now Nath's here why am I in the radiation yeah I've, I'm on it Nath I'm on it um, Rosie, get back inside and fix that that reactor, please. And Ash, get yourself to uh, get yourself to the infirmary. Stat. I need Rosie. You might as well stow it, Rosie. This has all gone incredibly wrong, hasn't it? Incredibly wrong. I'm going to slow time for a minute. 
and just take another breath and look over at you, my fine chat friends, and hope that I find some sort of... <laughs> Robert Price says self-destruct, self-destruct. Come on, Robert Price. It's, we're not there yet. I was looking for some sort of, uh, you know, positivity. So it turns out you can only slow time for an amount of time. I did not realize that. That's cool. Rosie, uh, pop in here. We need to restore power to the engines, please. Many thanks. And then we'll be heading to Uranus. Are we going to Uranus? Yes, we are. We need to get Ash back into the. Uh, just leave, leave, leave the medical bay. Ash, you'll be fine. So the medical bay, you can see it's got a little green circle around it. It doesn't. It's not like a forever thing. It will only. Uh, it will only work for, for like an amount. You can only heal so much with it. So many people. Joseph PS4 guy says you are go you are doing great, Cra Captain Jackson. Thank you very much. Although you've written Jav Javskson, which could be some sort of clever like. Wait a minute, there's enemies incoming. There are enemies incoming. There are enemies incoming. Not now. Wheeler, focus fire. I think you're in the you're in the hot seat. Oh God, Rosie, save us. Save us oh my god, we've got an asteroid coming from behind. That's no good. That is no good. I think we're doing alright. I think we're doing alright. We could boost stuff. Good work, everyone. That was actually incredibly impressive. Dan is still severely irradiated. I'm going to get Dan into the infirmary, actually. Let's just do that before we head over to, uh, to our destination. This is just a... There's more enemies incoming. Well, that's fine, because we're just... I tell you what, should we just go? I could just go. I will go as soon as they attack. Whatever whatever Dan's situation. Is that them? No. Is that Tiny Earth? Tiny Earth! That's us! They're not here yet. They're not here yet. Um, is Dan back... Dan is back in his hot seat, so we're going to go out of here. Let's engage. Engage. It's really hard to do a Captain uh, Picard. Right, I'm slowing time. I'm going to... Oh, Rob, he's in the gunnery seat, but I wanted to use him... I wanted to use his stealth ability. Can he get back in time? I mean, I'm here to clear the enemy, so it doesn't make any sense. Stay where you are, Rob, as you were. Um... Let's just let's re let's go back to to normal time. Actually, let's not accelerate time. Okay, let's tag. Then let's get Rosie to do, to boost. I want to go weapons, weapons. Then I want Ash get in the front seat, please. Get shooting. If there's anybody not here fighting, get here quick. Oh my God, there's lots. Of them. There's almost too many of them. Um, let's focus fire. Who can focus fire? Nathan can. Jackson. Evasive piloting, of course. And defensive piloting. Both of those things, please. I wonder if... Oh, that was lovely. God, that was good. God, we're good. I wonder if... Um, it's worth just tagging like one enemy, you know, and like focusing on that one. But I don't think that's I don't think that's the case. This is going alright. This is going alright. The only thing is we've got no scanner with Ash in the front. She's not actually shooting at anybody, so oh though now she will be. Let rip Ash. Fire. Fire you may fire as well, Commander. Although there's no commander. I made sure that as the hang on, I'm looking for boarding craft. I think that's a boarding craft. Oh god, there's so many of them. There's so many. There's so, so many. Are we getting boarded? Right, they're coming. They're coming. Right, slow time. Rosie, 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 I need you. Rosie, I need you. Engines down. Shields up. Uh, no, I need you. Rosie. Rosie, I need you to pick up your gun. Pick up your gun. I don't need to slow time now. Pick up your gun. 
attack enemies. Captain David. Oh my god, the front of the ship is in a very bad way. Um, Rob. Rob, I need you to get back because I need you to restore shields. I need you to restore shields, my friend, immediately. Captain David, no point in sitting in that chair. Let's get the gun. Let's get shooting. Uh, we need to lead from the front on this. We need to lead from the front. Rob, I need the shields immediately. I need the shields. And then Captain Jackson, attack enemies. Rosie can't do it by herself. Oh, she actually can. She's doing amazingly well. But come on. Although I am close to death. I don't want to die here. Captain Jackson can't die. He wasn't on the pole. Right, Jackson. Uh, you need to get... You need to get um, a health kit immediately. We are in such bad shape. Rosie, I need you back in engineering. How many of them are there? So many. Are there any that I've not... Oh, I've just not tagged a whole bunch. My, my medical bay has run out. There's more coming, Rosie. <laughs> oh, God. <gasps> Ash has died. No. Communications officer Millman is dead. The first one to die. Oh, God. Rob is close to death. Can you... He can't... Oh, God. Right. Rosie, get back on the gun. Get the gun quick. Get the gun quick. Dave. You need to heal self. Heal self. Bravely heal self. Uh, Nath is... Nath's doing all right. Where's Rosie? Rosie, Rosie, Rosie. Attack enemies. Please, Rosie. Please. Quickly. Oh, God. What have they... What have they taken out? The shield generator. The shield generator's taken out. Ash is my other... Rob is dead! No! Captain David is dead! What's happening? No! Oh my god! Okay, Rosie, the true best of us. And uh, you can you can still do this. Dan, get out of there. We need you to get a weapon and start shooting. Actually, go and, go and sort out the, uh, the shield generator. Rosie's going to shoot the, the aliens, no problem. Nath, what on earth are you doing? Get yourself a gun. Go and get yourself a gun. Rosie's okay. Rosie's okay. <laughs> oh, is this Nath, why are you getting a gun? You don't need a gun. Why is there... What are those numbers? What are those numbers? One of your crew is incapac incapacitated. Are they not actually dead? Oh, God. Are they not actually dead? Oh, no. Rosie, can you help Captain Jackson? <laughs> doesn't look like you should be able to. Am I, am I gone? He's gone. They weren't dead. They weren't dead. Alright. Just, everybody just stop for a minute. We are in such a bad way. Right, I'm not losing these. I'm not losing this. I'm not losing this. Right, I just need to have a, I just need to stop for a minute. Let's just stop. I tell you what. This is a lot, isn't it? God. That went... Oh my God, this is a lot. I should never have taken this mission on. I should never have taken... We should have stayed with low risk. Low risk. That's the way you, that's the way you do things in life. You go low risk. Low risk, low risk, low risk. And then you die happy at the end. Not midway through a medium risk. Oh, God. Let's recap. Officer, uh, officer, officer Millman was first to fall, uh, although it turned out she wasn't actually dead and I could have saved her. Then I believe it was Officer Pearson uh, and finally Captain Jackson bravely, bravely died whilst trying to heal himself. Um, please note in the ship's log that there are about three enemies remaining. There were three crewmen remaining. We have, I'm going to say Captain Caddick because, uh, frankly, Rosie's uh, conduct during all of these missions has been exemplary, and I'd like that to be reflected in uh, in a, a field promotion. Congratulations, Captain Caddick. Um, we've got Cool Ensign Dan Wheeler, and we've got 
radiation boy gunnery chief Nathan Dytum. We've got three enemies outside. We're going to need to destroy them. I need somebody to fix the shields immediately. Nathan, you can shoot them. And Dan, you can adjust the energy reserves whilst Captain Caddick's doing the good work. I think we've got a plan, ladies and gentlemen. We're going back to it. Let's do this right now. What did I just say? Right, uh, Captain Caddick, get out of there. I think that's irradiated. Okay, the shields are fixed. I need you to get back into the ener energy situation. Nath, what on earth are you doing? Please go and start shooting some people and wheels. I need you to do the same thing. Uh, our hull is getting absolutely fried. Returning to normal speed. Let's keep an eye on the inside. Surely, Nath, you can focus fire at this point. Focusing fire. Surely, Dan Wheeler, you can focus fire at this point. Focusing fire. Rosie, we all greatly respect you. Please uh, boost the energy. Let's get it to the weapons. Let's get this job done. Let's get this job done for the crew of the XS who have fallen. That's not all the enemies. That's not all the enemies. Are you, ser are you serious? That's all the enemies. <sighs> right. Good. Good. Look at the state of the excess. Look at it. My beautiful livery. My beautiful decal. Let's have a little moment. This music is unplanned, but very effective. It's not completely mournful. I think we need to get out of here. What am I doing? Because enemies will come back. We need to return to base. I've got no idea which way to go. Because... I mean, Earth's... Is that Earth? That could be... That could be Venus. Oh, God. Right. I need someone to go and man the... Uh, in fact... I don't have... I can't have a gunner. I need somebody... <gasps> but isn't it irradiated up there? Dan, you're going to go and sit in the captain's chair. Uh, Nath... You're going to go and sit in the comms chair. And hopefully... Is Dan getting injured in there? He just He's just irradiated constantly. I think they've just... Everyone's had a good old dose of radiation. Captain Caddick, I command you to have a health pack immediately. This is... Uh, Joe Hurley says, What a piece of junk! Hey! She might not look like much, but she's got it where it counts. Uh, right, good work, Rosie. Back into engineering, please. Uh, thank you, Dan Wheeler. Uh, oh, I've, I've put that in the wrong place. Dan Wheeler, I'd like for you to... Uh, oh, we've got enemies incoming, for God's sake. Which is the safest? Safest. Go. Go. Uh, and then, Dytum, I need you back. I need you to get in the front seat, I think. Front seat. Caddick. Yeah, we've got no engines, people. What are we doing back here? Come on. We're not going anywhere at this rate. So it's the, seri the series, al al uh, series asteroid belt. Asteroid belt, am I right? That was someone else's great joke. I'm just going to try and take some credit for it. So I don't know if they where the enemies are coming from. They came from behind. They could be anywhere. Pick up your visual scanning. The reactor boost is ready to use. I don't actually know what the reactor boost is. Oh, it's that. What's the overdrive? Overdrive. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Oh, no. No, no, no. I mean, we're in a very bad way here, so I'm tempted to just... No, we're not going to use Rose's boost. That would be foolish. Captain Caddick, I think you're going to have to lead from the front here. Oh, that was good. Well done, Dan. Look at Dan just doing all the hard work by himself. Actually, is that Nath? What a Nath! Look at Nath doing all the hard work by himself. Fantastic. Dan, why are you sitting in the chair? I mean, we're not going to... I'll tell you what. No. You might as well do something, Dan. How, how are we doing out there? It's actually gone very... I mean, that was... We're doing better with three people than we did with... Honestly. Right, charge. Let's get Nath back in... Uh, back in the uh, comms chair. 
Oh my goodness me! I tell you what, I tell you what! Uh, engage. Yeah, it's really hard to do a Picard impression. Can anyone do a good imp Picard impression? Engage. Oh, that was quite good, actually. Warning, asteroids. We don't need asteroids now. I might go fastest route now. Let's go fastest route. It's a bit closer. Um, what can we do? I'm going to have to put Nath back into the into the hot seat, I think. Dan, oh, just keep going. Just keep going. I can use the boost. Maybe now is the time for the boost. I'll wait till the enemies appear on the scanner. Then I'm going to boost. Then I'm going to send Nath into the into the hot seat. So what does overdrive do? Overdrive the reactor, making more units of power available for a short time. The reactor will leak radi radiation. No, let's not do that. Okay, boost. Uh, weapons, shields. Nathan, quickly. Hot seat for you. Go. Wheeler, you need to sit there whilst we make this the thing go. Okay, yes, I've got to scan the enemies, which is... I'll tell you what, if we were to get boarded now, it would be bad. It would be a bad. Oh, no. The rear shields are just getting absolutely pasted, and I can't... Yeah, go on, Nate. Go on, Nate. Go on. I don't think Dan can do any any good back there. We're close to the, to the gate, actually. Oh, no! Ooh. Great shot. Great shot. Okay, Dan, get us charged and out of here, please. What's this? Increased enemy activity. That's great. That's great. Uh, it's got to be Earth Athena Station. Let's go. We can maybe get there before anyone attacks if we crack on a little bit. Rosie, increase engines to in increase power to engines. Come on, everybody. We can almost do this. We can almost do this. Oh, Nath, get back in your in your comms chair. Go on. Come on, Captain Caddick. Come on, Captain Caddick. How far away? Oh, they're here. They're here. They're here. They're here. They're here. They're here. I've got to... I'm going to have to... Nath, get back in the chair. What were we thinking? What were we thinking? Get back in there! Um, there's no point in charging. We'll be destroyed. Rosie. I take back everything I said. Divert power to weapons immediately. Dan, do you just do your best up there. Do your best up there. I don't want to charge weapons because it will be it will be a bad. Is that a oh no 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 quickly quickly slow time, uh, Captain Caddick, Captain Caddick, I require your assistance. Get yourself a gun, Captain Caddick, and we're going into battle, my friend. Let's do it. Attack enemies, Rosie. You know how to do this. You know what to do. We have lost shields. We've lost rear shields. We've analysed it there, attack them, sir. There is a weak. Come on, Rosie. Rosie. Rosie, we, I need you to be really accurate now. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Swim. Swim through space. Swim through space. Follow the bad guys. Dan. Dan. Dan, you're in danger. Oh, my God. We've been boarded again. We've been boarded again. Oh, Rosie, please. Rosie. Rosie. Rosie, work on the accuracy. Come on. Come on. That's right. Now turn and fire. Turn and fire. Turn and fire. Right, Dan, you've got to get out. You've got to, you've got to get out of there. You've got to get out of there. Where is the gun? I've just popped it down and I have no... Oh, it's, I stowed it. That's quite good. Go, Dan. Go. Go, go, go. Come on, Rosie, because they're going to blow up all kinds of stuff now. Come on, Dan. Come on. Rosie, they're at the reactor. They're at the reactor. The reactor's damaged. Rosie, the reactor's damaged. Oh, please. Please. Oh, God. Oh no, oh god, and I've lost the chat. I've lost you, chat. Are you still there? I don't know. I don't know if it's if we're even still streaming. Help! I've got to pause. Are we still streaming? I've lost I've lost I've lost you all. I've lost you all. <laughs> I'm gonna try and get you back, I promise. Is it still happening? Are we still streaming? It looks like it's still going, okay. <laughs> Back to the action. Ah. It does mean I've lost the chat. Okay, right. Uh, let me think about this. Rosie, quickly now. You need to repair that. Dan, quickly now. You need to be the captain. I need to go outside. I think we've done it. Oh, we haven't done it. Oh, let's tag that. Come on, Nate. 
Come on, Nath. Fire at will. You may fire at will. Come on, bud. Who's Will? Ah, ha, 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 ha. It's that guy. That's Will. And I want him dead. We do need that, that guy to go. I'm going to put Nath on focus fire. Although... They're behind us. I need Rosie back in the... Back in engineering. Where's that enemy? Where's... Where's that enemy? Looks like they've gone. Looks like they've gone. So we're going to just... Let's charge. Let's let's get out of here. Oh, wow. Oh, God. We're back! Yay! It was that easy. And I think I can get... I think I can restore chat. Let me see. Come on, I need to speak to everybody about the disaster. Hi, chat, you're back. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Well, this is sad, isn't it? I wonder if we're going to get some sort of mournful uh, acknowledgement of the, my fallen comrades, my fallen colleagues. Of course, brave Captain Jackson and uh, officers Millman and Pearson. Congratulations if you voted in the poll uh, and you said um, I did I've done that I'm like yes good and you said uh, that Ash would be the first to die you were absolutely correct Ash was the first to fall uh, the first of us to fall upon this barricade so I don't know hopefully that's not that's a nice thing for you <laughs> you guessed who would be uh, who would who would die first I did not think that Captain Dave would die at all. So, um, right, let's, in let's enjoy this. Let's enjoy this, everybody. I can't believe Hupe and Garrett es escaped again. Look at that, the excess returned. Enemy force is cleared. It's a success, isn't it? It's a successful mission. David Jackson was sadly killed. Ash Milman was sadly killed. And Rob Pearson was less sadly killed. Meanwhile... Captain Caddick, I can't believe you didn't level up. That was well-deserved level up there. Very disappointing. PlayStation Access says, at least the good ones survived. Well, that narrows it down, doesn't it? Dan, I reckon. I reckon that's a Dan comment, that is. Radiation suit would have been good. Radiation suit would have been very good. Suit. I think we just bit off, bit off more than we could chew too soon. I'm very sad about it. So what have we earned? What have we earned? Listen to this sad military music. The radiation suit provides some protection from radiation. It seems like gunners are particularly uh, susceptible to radiation. Powered boots. These powered boots provide some additional, additional mobility to the wear. I wonder if you can get gravity boots, because I never have gravity on. Heavy gloves. Auto cannon, Mark II. Uh... Low emissions engine, a low performance, a low performance engine designed for safety. It allows moderate evasiveness and is not well armored. When damaged, radiation emissions are very low, mm, but it must get damaged more. Don't know about that. A plasma, a plasma cannon and auto cannon. That sounds good. A, new, a weapon pod that combines a plasma cannon and an auto cannon. Plasma cannon requires reactor power, so it does both. That sounds good. Okay. Right. Tomas Tomasi says three deaths. It's a success. This is the exciting bit, though, everybody. I mean, we're quite close to the end of the stream, but I now will be taking uh, recruits. I need some. I need some recruits. So I haven't done this before, but I will require some names from the uh, from the um, the chat. I mean, it would be nice, wouldn't it, to to get uh, Oliver Bath back since he's, he, he, he uh, first made an appearance in the Bomber Crew one. I think I will do that. I'm also looking for two more people. Is it, I think people in the chat need to nominate other people. I think that's what we need. Let's see. So who's going to be our comms officer? Uh, a level, th level three comms officer. I mean, I'm going to have to go on, on... What shall I go on? 
a 22-year-old comms officer who likes card games and like has a previous occupation software sounds useful painting less useful and some school qualifications not sure about that Lisa sorry Toby Morales he likes darts it's gonna have to be Marquez Amber Marquez you are recruited as the comms officer welcome aboard we'll decide who you are uh, briefly Holly and L people are saying I mean Holly and L seems I guess I guess that makes sense but I wanted someone from the chat Stephen Falconberry has nicely said Lucy which I am guessing to be Lucy Sobey because uh, Lucy Sobey is a regular on our streams and that could be that could be a nice sh shout Rodney Jenkins says Kefa uh, Joe Hurley says Grob Jackson Should we go? I don't know, but then, you know, I'm not sure. MJ Kefahuchi, no, that's 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 Rodney again. Rodney, that's twice. Ripley, Solo and Picard says, ha, ha, ha. It was a great shout. I'm going to go with Lucy Sobey. I'm going to go with Oliver Bath. I'm going to go with Domina. Domina? That's what you get, Domina. Domino. Uh, you, you you guys can make it in. It makes the most sense to me. Uh, we What else do we need? Captain. So who could we have? Captain Kaminsky. Weightlifting from Sao Paulo. Hi there. R Magdalena Robinson. Favourite colour is grey. <laughs> like your hair, Magdalena. And treadmill running. That's that's useful. Uh, Henry Wagner, I'm going to say. I like your attention to uh, detail with the, uh, the uh, uniform there, Henry. Uh, Favourite food is burgers. Good shout. Previous, previous occupation, architecture. Treadmill running, weightlifting. I'm going to go with uh, treadmill running, I think. Welcome aboard, Magdalena. And then finally, we need the security officer. Four security officers. Will it be David Franco, who likes sushi and is from Hamburg? It's like blind date. Come on down. Frank Moyer. A 43-year-old software engineer whose favourite food is burritos. <laughs> Why burritos rather than, I guess, burritos? Sushi and green for uh, Tian, Tian Go, or Abel Duran, Rio de Janeiro burgers. I'm thinking David Franco. It's a solid name, even though I'm about to, to change it. Welcome aboard David Franco. It's time to change their names. I'm not going to change appearances though because I have no idea, uh, you know, how, how Domino, Oliver Bath and Lucy Sobe look in real life. This, these could be the spit. Although I suppose I should probably change uh, someone's uh, gender. Because that is something I can do. And that makes sense. Okay, so who's going to be Captain... Captain Oliver Bath, I think. It makes sense. I think he survived the bomber crew uh, situation. So I'm going to make Oliver Bath a, a gentleman. And... Can commit him to uh, the history books. It is done. Then, uh, communications officer... I mean, this should really be, I think this should be Domino, as our our longest serving uh, our longest serving um, mod. That seems communications-y to me. Domino, last name 2097. Not not too easy. I'm Domino. I'm going to make you a gentleman as well, and then. Security Officer David Franco, of course, becomes Security Officer Lucy Sobey. And so, I can't speak and type, it seems. I'm not, how do I spell Sobey? I think it's like that. I've seen it. I've seen it a few times. Pretty sure it's like that. Welcome aboard, everybody. Uh, it's very near the end of this stream, so I'm going to crack on a little bit. Let's let's. Uh, what did we unlock? Oh, radiation suits. Oh, the thing is, our new recruits need stuff. They need stuff and things, or else they're going to die. Uh, oh, okay. Bath. Um, why are you irradiated already? Why why is that radiation uh, 
Oh, because to equip all that stuff, it's going to cost me 125 quid. Oliver, I'll do it. I'll do it. You're worth it. You're all worth it. Ah, Officer 2097. Good to see you. Okay, that's good. I'm not going to give anybody radiation gear, I don't think. I'm going to look at it. That's the wrong button. Here we go. Uh, oh, there's, there's gloves as well. Radi How much is radiation gear? So it makes us a little bit faster than currently, and it's nah, it's not happening. Not happening. Gloves. Ooh, that is. They are super. Look out! Look how tough they are. Fifteen, but it makes us another five slower. Uh, I'm not going to worry about it. And spacecraft. Let's do a little. Uh, Let's do some, I think weapons is what was exciting me here. We've got the Plasma Cannon Mark II. We might as well make these Auto Cannon and Plasma Cannon combos, I think. They're not that expensive. That's the wrong button, this one. It would be interesting. I'd like to know that this is gonna. This is the right move. I don't know it is. They're not so accurate, I, I'm noticing. So there's that. They are more accurate than just the auto cannons, though, are they? No. Yes. Okay. All right. We've got oh, we've got a thousand credits left, but I don't think there's anything. I don't want those new engines. So, right. Let's see how quickly we can all get killed. We're going to do a high risk mission. We're going to do a high risk mission, and we'll see how badly it goes. I don't have half the skills that I used to have. I don't think. Maybe I do. We'll see. Um. Let's recover a comms probe because I like I want to use the tractor beam. So we're going. We can take two jumps or three jumps. Let's see what we get. Good luck, everybody. Maybe time for a new poll. Straw poll. Who's going to die first on this mission? Because I'm pretty sure. I mean, because it's the end of the stream, I'm going to hurry a little bit, and I'm pretty sure someone is going to die. Uh, it's just a question of who. Captain Bath. I mean, I don't know why Rosie's been demoted from captain. I'm a bit annoyed about that. She's she's, she's the secret captain. Maybe she can be Admiral Caddick. Uh, Domino says, can't wait to be horribly murdered straight away. That's the spirit, Domino. I'll try and make it so. Um, right, so we have to go this way anyway. There's no quick route from here. Let's see how we get on. How's everybody doing in the chat? Please do uh, start sending in your guesses about who's going to die first. More than likely, somebody, that's for sure. <clears throat> and straight away, we've got enemies incoming. So let's go fastest route, which is the Asteroid Belt Gamma. And... Let me see. So Oliver Bath can fly defensively. Uh, Domino can call in fighter support. And Lucy can replenish shields. That's good to know. Rosie, I would like you to disable gravity and apply that gravity to the shields, please. Um, why are we not moving? Oh, we are moving, aren't we? I've just slowed down time. Un undo time slowing. Right, we've got enemies coming in hot. This is a high risk mission, and I'm not keen on taking any chances. Focus fire, Nathan. Oh, we're not firing very much, are we? It's so slow. It's so slow and ineffective. I thought we had 100% accuracy here, Nathan. What's going on? I haven't upgraded Nathan's weapons. I've only upgraded the side one. What's going on here? Your engin yeah, your engineer can boost stuff. I know that, but... Do I want to do that? I mean, we've got no shields. I'm going to actually Lucy replenish shields. Okay. Please. And then uh, Domino, get in the hot seat. Oh my god, the reactor is getting absolutely smashed. Rosie, quickly, quickly. You've got to. You, oh, we've lost. A, we've got, lost a bit of power. This is unbelievable. I know that this is a higher risk mission, but it's like insane. Nathan is almost dead. What's happened? What is this radiation again? I suppose it's because the because the we lost uh, shields. Oh my God. Dan, are you able to fire? Focus fire, for God's sake. 
Oh, I just, I don't, I don't feel able to, to do much here. I've zoomed right out. Let's pretend it's not happening. Uh, just pretend it's not happening. Nath, you do need some, you do need some, some help. I can't really, I can't really afford Nath to go anywhere because he's, he's one of the gunners. I've only got two, two stations, man, two gunnery stations. Come on. Come on now. Come on now. Come on, the people. We can do this. We can do. I'm really sort of out of our ideas. I feel very, very tense. Oh, there's more. There's new people, aren't there? There's new. There's new enemies incoming. This is great. This is fantastic. Rosie's getting quite irradiated. Rosie, why can't I see your? Uh, because you're. Because oh, you're fixing the. She's fixing the reactor. Oh God, that's the problem. That's the problem. That's causing a lot of the radiation sickness. Um, everybody just keep doing what you're doing. This is why I'm, I, you know, we never unlocked that, uh, we never unlocked that speech, you know, the rousing speech or whatever. Oh, Rosie's in quite a bad way. Rosie and Nathan in quite bad ways. Rosie is fixing the reactor, but how long can it last? Lucy, when can you replenish shields? Now. Perfect. Yes, please. If you could. That's a very good skill to have. I should be using that more. Come on, Rosie. Come on. Get that fixed. Get that fixed. Get that fixed. Uh, I've seen... Stephen says, but Dave just ain't no shepherd. I don't know what that, that's in... In, uh, in reference to, but of course, you know, even shepherd... loses his ship. Oh god, Rosie's in a bad way. That's felt I felt a big bang then. We seem to have lost shields again. Uh, Nathan is in trouble. Okay, quick, 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 Dan, Dan, go to Nathan. Take him, take him. Oh god, there's no health kits. Go and get a health kit. We've got 38 seconds. Rosie, you're gonna have to restore gravity at this point. We'll worry about the reactor in a minute. Right. Rosie, uh, wait, no, Rosie, hang on, slow time, right, Rosie, let's turn off the engines, let's apply gravity, Dan is going to heroically save Nath, revive crew member, yes please, this is going to work, this is going to work, I feel good about it, then Rosie, get back and fix the reactor, I think Domino's done it, you know, Domino, you've done it, like R2. Oh my god, Nath is way better. He's way better again. I can't believe I let the others die. That's so sad. And Rosie's fixing the reactor. Is it all going swimmingly? Although we've only got one health kit left. Which could be a problem. Uh, I'm going to have Rosie use the one by her. I think. <sighs> and we're just going to breathe again. I love this game. It makes me feel so alive, you know? Just so alive. Heal self, Rosie. Heal yourself. You earned it. And hopefully there's no more radiation. And hopefully the power is back. This is great. Everything's great. It's great. Turn off the gravity. I mean, Oliver Bath's not doing great. But I'm sure he's fine. I'm sure he'll be fine. Off to the Gamma Asteroid Belt. Right. It's increased enemy activity. One of my favourites. Domino, I need you to scan the route because I've got no idea where we're going. Please, if you could, to objective. That's the way. Oh, God. And Hugh and Garrett. And call in fire support whilst you're there. Yeah, let's do it. We must defeat Hugh and Garrett. Please. Please. And now, uh, 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 Domino, I do need you uh, to get back in the hot seat. Get back in the hot seat, would you? Cheers. Rosie, immediately boost power to weapons and shields. Oliver Bath, please fly defensively, for God's sake. I forgot, I, do you know what, in the last encounter, I feel like I just forgot everything. I've only tagged Hugh and Garrett because I want to destroy Hugh and Garrett, and that may be foolish. Lucy Sobey, can we replenish shields, please? Shields. Oh, God. Oh, no. No, no, slow time. Rosie, you know what to do. 
take no prisoners, Rosie. God, the reactor's damaged again. Attack enemies, Rosie. We've almost defeated Hupen Garrett, surely. Come on, Rosie, you've got this. You've got this. Nathan's getting a beating again. Oh, no. Rosie, fire the gun. Fire the gun. Fire the gun. Don't. No, 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 no. Oliver Bath. Oliver Bath. Oliver Bath. Uh, quick. Lucy. Lucy, help Oliver Bath. Oh, no, not the gun. The gu not the gun. The, the med kit. Rosie's got the gun sorted. Rosie's got that sorted. What is on fire? Is that something on fire? What's on fire? What is that? Rosie. Rosie. What is going on? What's this? What's that? What is that? Ah. Uh, right. Oh, God. Okay. Slow time. Drop your weapon, Rosie. Get the fire extinguisher, Rosie. And Lucy Sobe. Revive crewmate. Rosie. I love the slow down time thing. God, it's so so good. Extinguish fire. Go back to normal time. Okay. Meanwhile. Oh, Hupen Garrett has got away. Uh, absolute worst. I need to look inside again. Come on, Rosie. Just do the fire. Do the fire. Lovely stuff. Rosie. Just drop that. Just drop it. And then immediately... Oh, God. Run back to the reactor, please. Thank you. That was a big boom. What's going on? Lucy, where are you? Get! Don't just stand there. Honestly. Can you restore shields at this point? Replenish shields. No, not yet. She can't. Oh, God. Come on, everybody. Just pull it together. Maybe I should try and do a rousing speech. Replenish shields. Replenish shields. Come on, Rosie. You've got this. She's repairing the reactor. That's good. That's good. We're getting boarded again. Ah, oh, you know, at this point, I'm very tempted to just, like, let it let it end. Let it end. Like, I just want to welcome death. Nathan, get the gun. Nathan, get the gun. What a, what a fantastic movie that is. Oh, he's got gravity. He's, he's enemy. Attack enemies. Rosie. Um, oh, God, what's that? The shield generator's down. Come on, Nate. You've got this. You've got this. Oh, God, that's... that's that's going to catch on fire. What a Nathan. Rosie repair. Nathan. Just stow that. And then... Why is Nathan dead? Oh, Rosie, fix the shield generator. Nathan's dead. No, Rosie's dead. Okay, everybody pull. Everybody be cool. Everybody be cool. We're out of med, We're out of med packs. I'm out of med packs. There's nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do. Dan, get the fire extinguisher, put out the fire. Oliver Bath, don't just sit there. Do something. Lucy Soby, <laughs> replenish shields. <laughs> Oliver Bath, uh, you've got to do something, man. You've got to do something. Get in a gun. Get in a gun and start firing. Oh, I can't believe we're just watching Nathan Rosie die out there. They're dying, R2. They're dying. Dan, you've got to put out the fire. Extinguish the fire. Oh, it's horrible. Just a countdown to death. I don't have a med kit. There are no med kits, right? There aren't. I can't see any. No, I've used them all. I've used them all. I've used them all. Maybe it is time to self-destruct. Should we see the self-destruct mechanic? Dan! Honestly, what, what's wrong with you? Once you've done your bit, you've got to get back to work. Oh my god, I think we've done it. We're not dead. We'll be dead in the next bit. Oh, look at those bodies. There's a lot of radiation, isn't there? Loads of radiation. I just don't think... I just don't think... Look, I just don't... Th oh no. Oh god, everybody's already... At right, Lucy's going to try. Lucy's got to try. I can't give up. I can't give up. Lucy Sobe, get on a space suit, you're going outside. Oliver Bath, you're... I'm sorry. I'm truly, truly sorry. I'm sorry. 
Uh, Domino and Lucy have inherited the excess. And uh, they're going to try and they're going to try and salvage this mission. Never give up. Never surrender. Domino, go and fix the, radi the radiator. <laughs> go and fix the fix the radiator. There's a chance that they're going to decide to um, to self-destruct at the next enemy encounter. I'm just saying, it's a, there's a chance. Meanwhile, Lucy, you're doing you're doing some great work out there. I feel like you might be too irradiated to live. not gone well everyone. Domino is now alone uh, on the excess. He's too irradiated to do any to do any good back there. Domino, go and sit in the captain's chair. Actually, go, no, it's the engine. Go and sit in the engineer's chair. It's with a heavy heart that I do this. It's with a heavy heart, but it has to be done. On the brink of death, Domino, the last of his kind, hit the self-destruct button. But it was too late. He died before he could do it! No! No! It's the ultimate insult! I really wanted to self-destruct! It was going to be so cool! Oh, God! No! 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 I can't believe it! I tried, everybody. I mean, it says destroyed. Did it work? Oh, the skate pod. Oh, no. The chat's going to catch up. The chat's going to catch up. Well, if this hasn't made you, uh, if this stream hasn't made you think, God, I really want to play Space Crew. I don't know what will. Space Crew, one of the most intense uh, game experiences you can have. It's incredibly, incredibly hard. It's a real test of, of, of everything. It's a real test of metal. Uh, I don't mean the metal of your ship. It's a real test of, of management skills. It's a real test of just everything. It's so, so incredibly hard and so incredibly fun. I would never, ever, ever have done a high-risk mission there. Uh, in my own game. It was the end of the stream. I can't believe how much more difficult it was. It's insane to me how much more difficult it was. But but there you go. So um, write that into the history books. Uh, Officer Millman was sadly KIA first. Um, after recruiting officers uh, 2097 and uh, Sobi and Captain Bath, um, the remainder of the kill uh, crew, that's a bit foreshadowing there, were, including Admiral Caddick, were sadly uh, killed mostly by radiation and failed to destroy the ship, which has now probably been commandeered by the enemy and is being scrapped for parts. Hooray! It's another successful stream on PlayStation Access. Thank you so much for joining uh, me today, me and obviously the rest of the crew, but uh, primarily Captain Jackson. God rest his name. Um, I've had a lot of fun, believe it or not, playing Space Crew. It's a fantastic game. It's really, really good fun. Um, it is great to make people you know in in it and see how well you can uh, you can look after them. Which, in my case, is not very well. I don't know how you ever get someone past level six because everybody just dies. Everybody dies. So um, please do uh, have a go yourself. Um, we've gone a little bit early. It's it's releasing soon, but not quite yet. I should have done my research, but you, you know, if you've watched enough of these streams, you'll know that I didn't. Um, I just have been playing it and having fun. Uh, thank you for joining us today. We've got a full week, a full week of access ahead. As, as always, we're going to be streaming again on Thursday. Um, I'm trying to think whatever, uh, what other treats are coming up this week. There's stuff. There's stuff planned. There are videos happening. Um, so please keep checking back on the channel, get in touch, write comments, uh, reach out to us on, on Twitter, let us know how you're doing, what you're up to, what you'd like to see on the channel. Uh, we will do our best to respond as always. Or we'll just sort of nom it up like a lovely uh, comment sponge and we'll just, you know, soak up all the lovely comments and uh, forget to respond. So speaking of forgetting, I'm going to try and remember how to end the stream effectively. Uh, I'm going to wave a lovely goodbye 
and uh, I'll see you later in the week. Thank you for joining me. Thank you to my lovely crew, uh, my lovely recruits. I do appreciate it. I'm sorry it went so wrong. <laughs>